Hi, I'm Teresa Farney, the food editor at the Gazette in Colorado Springs. And nothing is more delicious than fresh pomegranate seeds. They're just beautiful. They look like little rubies. And they're gorgeous whenever you sprinkle them over a citrus salad of oranges. The contrast is just glistening and beautiful and delicious. But getting those seeds out of the pomegranate can be a real problem. I'm going to show you how to do it today. First of all, I wanted to show you the difference between a Costco pomegranate, look at the size of that, and what you can typically find at the grocery store. And about the same price, surprisingly enough, for each of them. So to peel them and get those seeds out like that, and it, as, as a matter of fact, this is the, uh, the amount of seeds that you get from one pomegranate this size. It would go quite a ways. So you want to cut off each end. And notice all this juice. Well, this is the problem. The juice is, will stain, and it um, just gets messy. It gets your hands all messed up. So what you do is cut off the ends, score the edges like this in about four places, then get, put it in a bowl large enough to cover the pomegranate with water, and let it soak for about five minutes. Then it softens this uh, tough leathery skin and see the seeds are just almost falling out of there and you just keep working with it and the seeds will pop out and just let them stay underwater as much as you can because again you'll get little sprays of that juice and it um, spatters and it stains it's not uh, pleasant but if you keep it underwater it's much more controllable the seeds will float to the bottom and this white membrane stuff that you see right here floats to the top so it's very easy to separate the seeds from this membrane and get them all out and have the, that hard uh, outside area become soft. And then you end up with a nice big dish of these gorgeous pomegranate seeds.